Let's dive into the Atlantic Black Sea Hare. If you're new here, I'm all things marine. Go ahead and click that subscribe button if you love the ocean as much as I do, and make sure you smash that notification bell as well so you don't miss out on any of the weird ocean creatures that I talk about. The Atlantic Black Sea Hare is a type of mollusk known as a sea slug that gets to be a little over a foot long, which is on the larger side for many sea slugs. If you live in Florida near a bay or the ocean, there's a good chance you may have seen this odd creature before and had no idea what it was. I have actually seen one of these washed on shore before and I did not know what it was at the time. In fact, it looked like a blob that was moving washed on shore, but I did not know that it was alive or a sea slug. These animals are not a danger to humans as they are also herbivores, consuming lots and lots of seaweed every day. When they lay eggs, they are laid as a long, hair-like, jelly-like string of eggs. They are sometimes called ink fish because of what they do as a defense mechanism. As you can see in this video clip right here, these animals can spray ink when they are startled as a way of trying to get away from a predator or trying to taste bad. Much like how octopus and squid can use ink to their advantage, which is very interesting because they are all mollusks, much like the Atlantic Black Sea Hare is. The Atlantic Black Sea Hare is very important when it comes to understanding the condition of the environment they are found in. They are very sensitive to changes and pollution, so they are oftentimes observed to determine whether an environment is healthy enough or not and to determine whether pollution is present. They get the name sea hare from the rhinophores, which are fairly large and resemble a rabbit's ears. Rhinophores are a type of sensory organ that detects scent. I could watch these animals swim all day. It is so satisfying, isn't it? The wings of this animal are actually called parapodium, and these parapodium wrap around the sea hare's body when it is not actively swimming, such as when it is laying on the ground. Make sure you smash that like button if you enjoyed this video, and just remember, if you see a black blob on a beach, chances are it is not just a black blob, but actually a sea hare.